I lived in my car for a stretch in the 70s. Nothing like betting a woman in the vinyl back seat of a Skylark. Of course, we didn't have the same safety standards back then, so <laughs> no condoms. I tell you, before AIDS, sex was like shaking hands. Hence AIDS. Oh, Brittles, I forgot to tell you, I uh, went and talked to Vaughn. What? Bad news is I could not patch up things between you. You really did a number on him. Good news is I'm the new keyboardist in his band. Oh, so I asked you not to talk to him, and you completely ignored me. Hey, Tiny, you're missing the headline. I'm in a rock band. Oh, I'd like to be there when the band finds out. Oh, hi, Jeff. We were just talking about how in today's economy... Uh, living in your car, living in your car, you are living in your car. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm not good at being coy. <clears throat> you guys are not living in my car. I'm just sleeping in it for a couple of days while I work out some problems with my condo. It's a very temporary issue. I've just got to pay some meaningless fees, and then they'll put my locks back on the door, and that'll be that. How are you going to get the money? Believe me, kitten. Winger's got moves. Jeff, do you need a place to stay? I'd offer, but my dad's kind of racist. You can stay with me in the dorms. My room has a bunk bed, which is kind of a misnomer because it's the real deal. The next person that offers me charity or pity will be mentioned by name in my suicide note. Oh. 